Hello there, I'm Lillian of the Book Coven, here a new month, Dark Magic, doing a solo review for Payback's a Witch by Lana Harper. So um, this one turned out not actually to be dark magic, it was surprising, and I like that. So but there we got three women who have been played by one asshole. And this asshole is a magical witch with the most power out of anyone in this town. So he's an extra asshole. So I thought it was going to be a bunch of women doing dark magic to get back at him and it would go too far. But actually the romance, like the revenge magic, was just a tiny, tiny part of the book. There's this whole magical tournament. It's like Harry Potter, but in like a cool way. Because Harry Potter, it's not for little, little fucking kids. It's... uh a gauntlet, three trials, and it decides which of the families, the witch families in this town, have the power for that time period. It switches, I think, every year, like every few years. And, I mean, it, these girls come together initially to take down this guy, but then it turns out to just be a story. Uh, two of the ladies fall in love themselves, and they have a beautiful, spicy relationship. And two of the other ones, they had um, a friendship and it's been kind of on the rocks for a while. So they just rebuild their friendship. And the three of them, it's like, I don't know, it's kind of like a Sex in the City sort of vibe, but like with witches. And I love how they talk to each other. It's like how I talk to my friends. They make references to spells and like pop culture that I understand. The book's beautiful. The uh, the chapters in here have little fun designs. And yeah, I just like the friendships that were formed and the three of them just rebuilding their lives. They each have something about themselves that like they hate or they want to fix or one's afraid of her power. One doesn't know what to do with it. And it's just a bunch of gals who were brought together by a piece of shit who go beyond that to be the badass witches that they are. And this cover is also beautiful. It's just hot lesbian witches that take down a man. Amazing. <laughs> and there's a little familiar in it. It's got, oh, it's got a variety of witchcraft. There's four families. One is like, um, one are necro there's a necromancer family. There's one that can control, um, they're like nature witches. One, um, they kind of get the short end of the stick. They're more just like, um, they record everyone else's history. They don't seem like they have much power, but then it turns out they're the most powerful of them all. And then there's the other, another one. I think they do the asshole's power. I forget because he was an asshole, but he could control like elements or something stupid like that. Oh, and he thought he was so fucking cool because he can control the wind. Good for you. But yeah, they, like the and the the puzzles that they have to fucking figure out and this weird magical trial thing they have to go through, they're exciting, they're fun. It's a short book, so you can just plow through it. There's lots of drinking, which was so much fun. Lots of drunken talks with girls. Love it. It's just really fun, you know? It's uh, like uh, anyone coming together to help a friend who got dumped, but with insane magic, which is awesome. So check it out. Payback's a witch. Bye.